Another focus for Earth Day is to make sure that the next generation knows all about it. John Monk was in Finley where future teachers got a firsthand look at the lessons of renewable energy. Welcome to Earth Day 101. Today's lesson, renewable energy. Look at how these University of Finley students got to see firsthand how wind turbines provide direct to consumer power for local industry. Now here's the thing, many of these students are education majors and the hope is they get a first-hand understanding of renewable energy so they can pass that understanding on. I'll become a better educator in ways that I can teach kids why it's important that these things exist, why they're good for the community and why they should be uh, more exposed to this sort of thing. And when it comes to workers who know this stuff, class visits like this go way beyond just sharing what their company does. They say it's all about instilling a deeper understanding of how important renewable energy is. There were so many people that were wonderful to me educationally and, and as just an adult in my life that I want to be able to help these people go on and help younger kids then and kind of continue that uh, that growth mindset across yep. generations. And though all of these students here today are not all going to become future educators upon graduation, UF and One Energy still felt it was important to give them all an on the ground first hand understanding of how local renewable energy works. Not everybody's going to be a teacher. They may be working in the business setting. They may be, may be working um, at a corporation where this type of um, technology could be implemented there as well. One Energy reps say they host a lot of school field trips throughout the year and they also offer professional visits on their North Finley Wind Campus, blowing the minds of future generations with what they're already seeing each and every day. Reporting in Finley, I'm John Monk, WTOL 11.